in terms of fuel and the time you spend in traffic. So why not switch to the two wheels lifestyle? Like that. You want a bike that looks good, but also is not necessarily for a super mega professional. So where do you begin? You begin at Nairobi Power Bikes. Oh yeah. Very fine, how are you? My name is very fine, thank you. My name is Yafeti. Glad it's here. This is the famous Nairobi Power. Nairobi Power Bikes. Yeah. Yes. Okay, Power. What kind of bikes do you need? Okay, now every time uh, we have a customer, uh, the first thing uh, we need to understand is what kind of a bike are you looking for? Mm -hmm. So from there, we are able to guide you. So we started uh, six years ago. We started with the riding gear. The riding gears are things like riding jackets, helmets, gloves, knee guns, elbows. Things like bands that are uh, used for riders. Ah, so when did you get to, to the bikes now? Three years ago, we started uh, with the bikes. Uh, but now we started with bikes uh, that are called YCR and Zongsheng. And those bikes were air cold. So nowadays, we only deal with the oil cold bikes. Oil cold bikes have the oil coolant. And the bike that is oil coolant is able to go for a very long distance because it's not going to heat. Yes, indeed. But that knowledge alone does not make me an expert. So when you have someone coming in, like, I'm not an expert, I just decided I can't afford a car and I, or I want to save cost. So I sold my car and I want to buy a bike. You don't just give me what I want. Give you, we have to sit down to consider the roads that you're using, uh, whether you need the speed and the distance. If you, you'll be going for like places like terrain, bushy places, then you need uh, an adventure bike or an or, or a off-road bike. A bike uh, that has the off-road Tires, yeah, you know, like this one. Yeah, like this one. Mm -hmm. Not all bikes go wherever you're thinking of going or do whatever stunts you may have prepared. Every time you look at a bike like this, you need to learn uh, a few things about the bike when it comes to engineering aspects. So, when you look at this bike, uh, you can be able to see that it has the inverted shocks. These inverted shocks are to make sure that uh, when you get to potholes, bushy places. Uh, it's going to absorb that effect of the pothole when you just break suddenly. Uh, what happens is that you cannot overtake the bike. Or so, you won't go flying. Yeah, you, you cannot. Mm. This one is called uh, uh, oil coolant. Yeah. It is yeah, oil coolant. Right. In an engineering aspect, when you see a bike that has the oil coolant, it means that you can go for a very long distance without the bike heating. And really, you visit the technician. If you can look at this uh, Tekken 2023 design, it has the crash pads. Remember that this bike is meant for terrains, bushy places, so probability of falling might be higher. Yeah, higher. Super, super yeah. So when you have a bike that has the crash guard, if the bike falls, your steering will always be clean. Okay. So it's not going to crash. This bike has the engine guard. It means that uh, that bike is made for terrain, mm -hmm. eh? rock. very rough mm -hmm. terrain. Yeah. So it's not going to harm the engine. The engine will always be intact. Yes. Yeah. If you look at any bike, that has the double exhaust okay. and, uh, and okay. they are elevated. Yes. They are above the tires. This bike is made for bushy places, mm. and bushy places, uh, probability of even getting water there, getting the, uh, it's rain, it has rain. Yeah. yeah, so it's so high. Mm. If, the, if the tire uh, sinks, there's no problem. The only problem would be when the exhaust yes. gets the water. Remember, exhaust is like your nose. Yes. If you cannot breathe, you cannot mm -hmm. walk. Yeah. You said this one is 2023. Yeah, it is a 2023 design. And does anyone else have it? No one else who has the 2023 design. And in fact, Nairobi Power Bikes is the only company that is selling the Tekken bikes. And that's why we, are, we have the 2023 design. This bike is a 14 liter tank capacity and it has a one liter um, reserve. What distance does it cover in a full, on a full tank? Uh, it is about 35 to 38 kilometers per liter. This one can make it a bit more. And, and it is a 19.7 horsepower. Something else, it has the handguns, 
Yes. When you indicate, mm -hmm. it is the boxes will also indicate. Oh, even the boxes? Yeah, the ah, boxes yes, will, yes, is yes, go, yes. are going to indicate. Mm -hmm. Speaking of boxes, the Tekken bikes have a small do-it-yourself element to them. When the bikes comes here, uh, they are partially assembled. So we only uh, put a few things, yes. like the tire mm -hmm. and the side mirrors. Okay. Yeah. Due to budget, some of us might be tempted to take shortcuts on the necessary safety gear. With regard to safety, what does it mean to have dot certification? If you have a, a helmet that is ECE DOT certified, you can be very sure that that helmet has been tested before and has been qualified to be a good quality helmet for your safety. Yes. Yeah. If I'm to fully keep myself helmet to okay, good like I exclude the zippers. So adding everything, jacket and all that, how much would I spend? A riding suit is jacket and the trouser. That one is 19,000. 